Hey, welcome to my channel. So my name is Esther Jennifer, and in this video, I'm going to be your personal tutor, and I'm going to teach you how to start your YouTube channel with just your mobile phone. So you don't basically need everything, like ring light, tripod stand, a microphone, a cam to get started. All you need is your mobile phone, and I'm going to be putting you through step-by-step -step method on how to get started. So I'm going to be like telling you what to do and what not to do, the mistakes I made when I started mine and I'm going to put you through that. So, let's get started. So, I'm going to be asking you some basic questions. Like, why do you want to start a YouTube channel? You should probably have a reason why you want to start a YouTube channel. Like, why do you want to start? Like, what is motivating you to start a YouTube channel? So, remember that everyone can start a YouTube channel, but not everyone can consistently remain on YouTube. Also, what do you want to post on your YouTube channel? Like, what do you want to share to people? What do you want to share to your friends? Is it entertainment? Is it a vlog? Is it how to cook? Is it how to do makeup? Like, what do you want to share on your YouTube channel? And also, who are going to be your audience? Who are the people going to watch your videos? Are there people who are into fashion, baking? Like, this is going to help you in terms of focusing on, on your niche. It doesn't have to be one, it can be three, but then they should be related. So that aside, we're going over to the phone. But please, I beg you, before you get your phone to start filming, please make sure you have over 50 video ideas which you're going to upload on your channel. You don't want to finish your first video and don't have an idea of what to post next. Yeah, so please get at least 50 video ideas which you're going to upload on your channel. And also, before making your first video do research you have to plan get a pen and paper research on that topic which you're going to upload if it's a daily vlog share do on how it's going to be then write out the bullet points so you don't make mistakes so it's going to, it's going to be in order where when you're filming the video yeah you can write them down just write the heading of each point when you're going to film the video so it will help you not to go out of words or not to skip anything while filming your video. That aside, I'm going to start with the phone. So before you start filming, please make sure you have a battery percentage that is over 50% because you don't want to be filming and then stop filming. And also please make sure you have enough space on your phone. Yeah, that is going to help you because you might be filming and then stop filming without your nexus. Yeah. Also make sure you use the landscape and not the portrait camera. If you go to my first video when I start my YouTube channel, you notice I used the I used portrait instead of landscape, yeah, which really affected me. Yeah, but then on YouTube it's best to use landscape and not portrait. And also preferably use the back camera and not the front camera but then if your phone camera is bright enough you can use the front camera but preferably use the back camera or if you want to be seeing your face fine use the front camera so now you have a topic ahead you've written them down it's time to film yeah so once you get your camera your phone camera you set it up so for your ring light, use the natural light. So you have to film during the daytime. Yeah, and also for your tripod stand, you can place it on the table as I'm doing right now to film this video and it's going to come out perfectly fine. No one's going to notice you didn't use a tripod stand to hold your phone. Or you just place it on the table and then it's balanced properly and then you start famous. And please, once you start filming, try to pause check if it's okay if the background is okay and everything is okay for you then you can continue so going over to the editing part once you're done filming going over to the editing part i'm going to make a detailed video on apps to use on your mobile phone to edit your videos so kindly you subscribe to my channel if you've not subscribed to my channel to get more videos because you'll be the first person to know whenever i post a new video so for editing, I recommend using InShot or Filmora to edit. 
these apps are watermark proof free so you can use them to edit your videos yeah in short it's easy and it's something you can do even if you're starting for a beginner you can do it using in short to edit your videos so you can also use Filmora if you want to buy recommend in shorts and i'm going to list others in my next video in a video i'm going to do on apps to use to edit your videos on youtube so once you're done editing going over to the thumbnail please make sure you use a bright picture of yourself and also your write-up should be bold enough and it should be catchy it should be something catchy preferably if you want to help you to take a picture of yourself so it's going to be catchy and going to be bright and fine yeah <laughs> so if you don't have a youtube channel all you need is your email address so you go on play store using the play store app and download the app but then if you do have youtube youtube app already on your phone all you have to do is to click on it you have to sign up you you have to put your email address and your password and then you're going to change the profile picture please use a recent picture of you as a profile picture don't leave a picture from google as your profile picture and then your youtube channel ads you can use a picture of yourself or you can use um just a description of what your channel is all about basically and just a little write-ups or then your picture if you want to add a youtube channel ad to use something catchy as your youtube channel ad and then your profile picture so once you're done with that you're now free to upload your picture so on your channel you can add description about yourself your hobbies what you love all those things you're going to see them which you're going to feel then you're going to upload your video so please during your planning as i said earlier you have to look for a topic a catchy topic topic which is searchable on youtube so you use that topic and then on the description what your video is all about and you can always feel free to add your social media handles and then you're free to add tags to promote your videos if you want to yeah that's going to help so once you're done with that you're going to put in your thumbnail and then you're going to upload your video yeah that feels good right yeah so once you're done uploading your video you can now start sharing to all your social media platforms your friends we tell them to please subscribe to your channel please so subscribe to your channel to watch your video and guess what they are going to subscribe to your channel they are going to watch your video because this is the first time you're uploading they're going to be like let me see what this girl is up so let me see what this guy is up to and you're going to click on that please share to all your social media handles they are yours and you you can do anything you want with them upload your video and share to your friends to watch your video to subscribe to your channel so that is the first way to start getting subscribers yeah so you can also feel free to tell them to leave a comment and to help you share your video so once you're done with that we've got it there so once you're done with that you can now relax and inhale you just did it girl kudos to you you just did it you just did something you've never done for the first time and i'm super proud of you yeah so i hope this video really really helped someone feel free to pop champagne once you're done sharing your video and uploading your video see is that easy so you don't need everything to get started you've been thinking and wondering how will i start a youtube channel even no matter where you are even here in nigeria you can do that i know it is kind of expensive here in nigeria because of the data you're going to spend but then you can do it and i'm going to make a video on how to start a youtube channel on a low budget with no money with no money on youtube so i do hope this video really helps someone remember you're likely to make it on youtube because youtube is the world's second largest search engine and is the second most visited place after google so you're likely to make it on youtube let me know in the comment section if this video really helped you and also let me know what you're struggling with and i'm going to see you through do have an amazing day lots of love all of you Bye-bye.